G'day everyone, Damn Collectibles here, back with what could possibly be one of our last MetaZoo videos, um, at for least for anyway. Nightfall, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm joined again today here with just one of my friends today. How's it going? Uh, we're just going to be opening up a, a booster box. I apologise for my croaky voice at the moment. Um, <laughs> hopefully it comes all right, like across all right on camera. But yeah, we're just going to be opening up a Nightfall booster box today, all 36 packs, and we're going to be putting them in our Nightfall sleeves, which came in the uh, spell book. Uh, so we're searching for potentially um, about 40 odd cards to complete the master set. Um, some of these cards are quite a few of the big hitters. Still missing a full Hollow Mothman for my complete master set. Still missing. Reverses of Wendigo and uh, Headless Horseman, and we're also looking for um, like some of the regular rares of just some of the cards as well. So yeah, I think you still need like the Crazy Critter Reverse Hollow, the um, the old books Crying Tree Reverse, yeah, the Santa Squink one. Oh, Wonk, yeah. No, oh, like... oh, yeah, the electric one. Yeah. Yeah, I, think, I know what you mean now. Yeah. I'm just trying to cut this one nicely because, as you know, I'm usually not a really, like, careful with a lot of these things, but I kind of want to be for this box, being as it's probably the last one I'm going to ever get to open. So we just get that nice there. Nice you don't security know, um, label. If you don't want to cut the security label, you can usually push it down. Oh, I've already cut but... it. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Might as well just finish the job. Yeah. Alrighty. So we'll put the knife off to the side there. No, I won't. I'll use it to open the box. Yeah, they're a bit tricky to keep those. To get... Yeah, there we go. Just got to be <coughs> real gentle with it. I think one of our last ones we tore. Yeah, I tore mine. Because <laughs> <laughs> I was too excited to get into it. <laughs> um, if you don't know too... We'll probably show this off in one of the videos. It's a nice little skull right down there. Oh, yeah. It's a little hard to come across on the camera. Um, but my mate actually got an error box where it does not have the holographic print on it. Yeah. It is actually kind of really cool. I think it has this holographic print, but none of the blue. Yeah, none of, none of any of this is holographic. Um, we should also try to see if the, the uh, glow-in-the-dark feature works on that one True. too. That might be... A cool thing to do. Yeah, when we do a nighttime video, we'll figure that one out. Yeah. So, like usual, we've just got our regular packs on top with the four artworks. Always looks lovely. We're actually going to pull all these out. I think I might just pull them out in random orders. I want to shuffle it up a bit and see if that'll make a difference to the video. See if we get more even spread of pulls because I noticed... Um, in one of, like, two of our other booster box openings, it was basically like we got all the good cards at the beginning. right at the top, and yeah. then the whole rest of the box was just reverses, so we maybe switch it up a bit. Keep them off to the side. We'll move this box off to the side now. But yeah, we might just leave it like that and see how we go from here, guys. So, 36 packs. You know, open them fairly quickly now that you've already seen probably a hundred videos on um, on Nightfall by this point. So we're just going to try to move through them a bit quicker than usual. I hope you guys have really enjoyed this though. Like, we've had an absolute blast opening up all these cards. But, oh, there's one that I needed. Nice. Purple Blob of Philadelphia. And I got a River of Time. Oh, on yeah. Hollow. Uh, yeah, we've had a blast opening up these. Um, this might not be our last video because we still have a couple that we we might want to open just for a chance to get like old scratch or you know we might end up buying some off eBay for more than retail price. But you know we'll just have to see what happens when it happens. But um, for the moment, we're just moving through these. I think that's the full hollow there. Yep. And the flood the earth. <laughs> non hollow. 
Yeah, when you get down to missing three cards or something for a master set, there's not much point opening anything else. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's true. Like we don't want to be wasting potentially three hundred US dollars on a box when we need three cards from the entire set. Oh, there we go, Thunderbird full hollow. That's quite nice. I actually bought one of these off eBay the other day to try to complete the set, so it's Oh there we go, another card that I needed. Yeah. Divine Covenant. So I'll get you to sleeve that, that one up as well. Yep. Oh, I've got my favourite terror card. Man, that's a nice looking artwork. Uh, yeah. This has been a really fun time opening these all up and being able to share it with you guys and share it with my friends. It's honestly been some of the most fun I've had in the, the past year, obviously, with quite a lot of things going wrong around the world. Oh, another one that I needed. <laughs> the Wood Devil of Coos Country. He's a creepy looking bloke, eh? He is. The like antler pincer looking things on his head. He's a beastie Sasquatch, so he's part of the Sasquatch tribal boost. Oh, whoa, we just had a landslide. <laughs> Yeah, they don't like sitting on top of each other. Yeah, that's what I miss about the um, Cryptid Nation ones with that matte finish. Yeah. They were really just like, you could stack them real well. This is not doing... Oh, we're going to lose them again soon. <laughs> there they go. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I'll just leave it. <laughs> so, yeah. What are we going to have in this pack? Hopefully some more good luck. Yeah, I don't know, this set has been amazing. Ooh, old, old book's crying tree. I need the reverse of this one, but I'll quite happily take another one of these. He's, a, he's got the bat under the thing as oh, well. Nice. Got ghosts and the... Oh, and there's a skull up there too, so we got all four on one card. Hmm. Nice. It seems to be something hard to come by. Yeah. Is you get all four of them in the same like frame, I guess, you could call it. Especially the yeah, so I hope you guys have um, enjoyed the MetaZoo though. Um, we'll probably take like a slight break. We're going to try to like spread these videos out through some Pokemon ones. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got a Veggie Man. <laughs> I got the full Hollow Moth Man. So I'm missing this guy in the reverse as well. It'd be really nice to be able to pick one of them up. The witch I'm missing as the reverse. Wow, that's great. I actually pulled it. I didn't think I was going to, so I'm kind of happy I opened up my last box. Um, but yeah, we're going to have more MetaZoo. Hopefully in the future, we should have some of the Valentine's Day set coming, which, you know, obviously it's nowhere near Valentine's Day by the time... Sorry, I just bumped the camera. Um, obviously it's nowhere near... Um, Valentine's Day anymore, but oh, there we go, another one that I need. Jeez, this is crazy. I might end up just getting the full set from this one box. Um, um, we got the Valentine's cards coming, so we should have a couple of those to open up for you guys. Uh, we're also hoping to get some of the the wild. What is it? The Wild wilderness, wilderness not club. wildlife. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then when wilderness cards come out, we'll hopefully be getting some of them too. Uh, my friend also funded into the Kickstarter for the playing cards, so we will definitely have at least a video showcasing what those look like. Um, I was really interested in some, but I didn't manage to get around. I'm pretty sure the Kickstarter's closed by now, especially by the time this video goes up. Ooh, Napa Rebots. I'm not certain if I need that one or not. Um... But yeah, I really liked how the um, Nightfall cards look. They look fantastic, especially like Wendigo as the king. And, yeah. You know, he's got like the cape and the crown on and that. It looks, they look really cool. So hopefully we'll be able to, you know, showcase some of them for you guys. And um, we'll continue to do this down the line because honestly, these cards are fantastic. Oh, full <laughs> hollow injured coal as well from the same box. You and there's a, there's a bat on there. Yeah, I do have him. Okay. So we've got the bat. We've got 
spider webs. There's a skull down here and in the corner there. We're just missing the ghost on him, I think. It's a bit upsetting. Frank Shaw's gargoyle. That's your ghost. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice. So we got all four on him as well. Yeah, it'll be um, it'll be interesting to see what the future of Mezu holds. Um, it's definitely gaining quite a bit of traction, which is nice, but. That also makes me a bit scared that we might not be able to get things to showcase. Oh, the reverse holo of Dark Watches, another card that I needed to get. And Hell's Gate as the regular rare. That Dark Watches card is one of my favourites in this set. Um, I like that reverse holo along the bottom. Yeah, where it's like the fog's all holo. Yeah. yeah, it looks nice, eh? Um... We pulled a full holo of the Dark Watches um, out of one of my friend's booster boxes, so... But there's definitely a lot of cards that seem to be harder to get than normal, like... I'm missing the um, Headless Coal Miner as a regular rare. I'm missing, um... Potion Seller Reverse. Yeah, Potion Seller Reverse. Like, I had to I had to buy the full holo version of that. Like, there's definitely cards in here that are a lot harder to get. Um, than others. Oh, we got a boil over. Oh, and a Grim Reaper. We need Wendigo as a regular rare as well. I was really hoping that... Wow, there's so much hollow pattern on that. Look at that. On the camera. Yeah. Look, it's just everywhere. <laughs> Jeez. Um, yeah, I, I don't think me or my mate have pulled Wendigo as the regular rare yet, have we? No, we did, we did in the last <laughs> box you got. That and the reverse. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, man, like, it's crazy. Like, like, Flood the Earth, I have so many regular rares of. <laughs> and then, like, other cards, you just can't even get a regular rare of it. It's a bit mind boggling, to be honest. So, we got Aura Prowl, Snapper Rebops, Kindle Blob, I still need the reverse of that. Uh, Familiar, I think I have the reverse of that. I'm not 100% sure. We've got a Lightning Alley full holo. I'd love to get more of the regular rares that I need because they're even sort of hard to source on eBay, let alone um, pulling them from a pack. I'd honestly like to get more of the reverses now. Um, it's one good thing about spellbooks being mostly reverse. Yeah. Like I said, I still need him as a reverse. I think I need Cabbage Town Monster as a reverse. Yeah. I've got Boogeyman. Oh, Guardian Angel Full Hollow. And we've got the regular Air Potion Seller. <laughs> that's, a, that's still one of the nicest looking cards in the set, I reckon. It's quite good. But yeah. But tell me, are you guys sick of the MetaZoo content yet? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I love it, to be honest. This is the most fun I've had at opening up cards in a while. Um, but the only other thing was when I opened up the Digimon packs for the first time. But sadly, we didn't record any of those. Um, nice. Another full oh. hollow inch coal. And of course, we got Headless Horseman. <laughs> like the one card I don't need as a regular air. I still need Injured Coal as a regular air. Uh, Wendigo. And Grim Reaper. No, though. I've got the Grim Reaper. I need the full hollow of Grim Reaper though. Yeah. But this is cool. Now I can play this guy in the deck. Even though I won't have like the style points of the hollow or anything. I'm still pretty stoked that you know I've got one of them to make a deck out of now. Because I've got like injured coal as a copy as well and everything like that, so it'll be quite nice to um Get some decks built and play some games for you guys and showcase it. Oh, oh and I got Flood the Earth. <laughs> I actually bought this the other the other week. It's a nice double to get though. It's a nice card for sure. Now I can potentially trade this to you for something. Because yeah. I think you're still missing it. Yeah, I don't think I've pulled this yet. It's cool that now I think I've pulled every single one 
of the um, Unlucky Unlucky 13, 13. other than Divine Covenant as a hollow. So that's quite nice. It's still easily one of the best cards in the set, I reckon. Mm. Like, playability-wise and looks. looks. Like, I just love the Loveland Frogman sitting up there, swinging his wand. Like, (laughs) Oh, and we got Jack Frost Reverse. Ooh. It's one that I needed. And Momo. <laughs> <laughs> I still think he's the Bigfoot. But I don't know, I change my mind. I think he's Sasquatch. Where does it say that? Yeah, that oh, up the top. top. Yeah. yeah, it is. You have two of them. I love his move too. It's called Stinky Punch. <laughs> <laughs> So I think we're about halfway through the box now. Got some pretty good pulls so far. Like, I think I've gotten at least like five of the cards that I already needed yeah. or something like that. Um, really good hollows. Yeah. 200 coals from the one box and a Mothman. Thank you. <laughs> like, I'm kind of glad I... So, sorry about the mess over there too, guys. I just don't want to drop it all on the floor and have to pick it up later anyway. I'm getting some pretty good pulls though. Momo Fall Hollow. This is another one I got the other night. <laughs> uh, Wood Devil of Coos Country. I'm not sure if I needed that or not. I don't know. I'll have to check the binder after this. I think I'm still missing the snowing um, terror card, which is a bit upsetting. But honestly, I'm quite happy with a lot of these pulls so far. I don't think there's been many reverses either. Like maybe like four or five. And Lightning Alley, Napa Rebops, Jack Frost, the Purple Blob, uh, the Coos Country fella. Oh, running out of room. Feel free to just double stack and we'll probably um do a wrap up at the end. Yeah. Oh, Guardian Angel, I've got so many of these in the <laughs> reverse holo. Oh, we started off well like every other box and it's starting to fall apart like usual. This it time was, it was reversed because yeah. I pulled all the bottom packs out and put them on the top. I might get better in a minute. Yeah, hopefully we get an old scratch. It would blow my mind. If I could have a 1 of 100 card ever made, it would be absolutely crazy. Oh, That's yes, one. Veggie Man. One you need. I needed him. I like this card. He looks creepy as. I still think I get like a salad fingers vibes from him. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. Well, I'm getting some good ones that I needed to complete the set and getting some good double ups, that's for sure. Um, Still love a full holo Grim Reaper card. A Wendigo reverse and a normal one. I suppose you can't get them all, but it'd be nice to have some of them. Oh, Spectre Moose, that's another one that I needed. So that's nice. That's actually quite nice looking. That reminds me of Ghost Deer from the Cryptid Nation set. Yeah. We've got Daytime and the Earth Aura. Probably has a similar story. The Ghost Deer is just meant to be ghosts of deers in the forests. Yeah. So this is probably similar. Permafrost, I need that as the reverse, not as the full hollow. I'll still take it though, because I think you need that. Uh, I think so, I think I might have a spare I think reverse. you have the reverse and I've got the full hollow. So, we'll be able to do some swaps soon. Sorry, I keep bumping the table to them. Sitting a little awkwardly compared to usual. Hopefully, um... Maybe in the near future or something, we can get like a proper studio if one of us gets a house. Ooh. Ooh. I don't think I have that yet. I think I do, but I think it's because I bought it the other day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's cool. That'll be another tradable option. That's if... I think you might still open up a box, maybe. Maybe. Yeah, probably. You should probably double check what 
your close to and your master set first because like yeah. you said you don't want to open up a whole box for three cards yeah exactly because i'm pretty sure you opened up more than i did um what are we got in this one oh <laughs> full hollow divine covenant i purchased this the other day too i knew i shouldn't have done it <laughs> <laughs> Oh well, Ooh. might be a cool card to use in a deck or something. I don't know. So we're about two thirds of the way through the box. No sign of old scratch, sadly. But another boil over. Um. I hope you guys are enjoying the video as always. Um, again, I apologise for being a bit, a bit um, worn out today and everything like that. So, also I hope you do uh, like don't mind that I have a big cat scratch on my <laughs> hand. <laughs> so, yeah, one more pack. Let's see what we got. Ooh. I think I needed this one, the Bandage yeah. Man of Cannon Beach. So that's nice. I might need him. I really hope I need him. Pretty um, sure you do. Then we got Lightning Alley. All the token cards and everything. What have we got left? One, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven packs to go. <coughs> Still haven't seen a god pack. No, a god pack would be nice. Yeah. But um, I'm imagining they're fairly rare. <laughs> Jack Frost full hollow. Oh yeah. I've already pulled one of these, but that's another trade I think I can offer you now. I thought I did pulling. No, I think you got the reverse. Okay. I think. Don't, don't quote me on that, though. Yeah, I think you might be right. Again, like, this is what annoys me, is the regular rares all seem to be real similar. Like, I've pulled, like, four Hell's Gates card now. Oh, i got snowing, so <laughs> if I am mistakenly missing it, um, now I've got it. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to, like, um, pretty much as soon as this video finished, I'm going to bind up the rest of the cards that I need. And see what we have. Well, injured coal, a mothman. What, reverse injured? Yeah. Yeah. I want um I want Wendigo. <laughs> <laughs> I've got heaps of injured coals now. I'll be able to sell them, which would be nice to make a bit of money back on the purchases, but um like I'm only gonna keep what's required for like per spell book and then i'm gonna try to like sell off the rest so if i end up making an ebay store and you guys are interested oh, lightning split and born from the earth that's still a nice looking card um if any of you are potentially interested i'll put them all up on my ebay store and uh leave like a link in the description for anyone that's wanting to get some of these uh i'll probably do ones where it's just like non hollow cards and then mm. a couple of reverse hollows, or and then I'll probably singly sell some of the like more desirable cards. Oof. But, um, oh, Guardian Angel again, and another Mothman. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. Like, the regular air always seems to be like. I don't know. It's like always a pattern that it's like Clumped Mothman up. or it's um, Hell's Gate. Is yeah, it Hell's it? Gate. It's, you know, and then like Lightning Alley and the, a few of the other like abduction and that usually pop up quite a bit. Come on. This is a Wendigo pack. You've got to give me a Wendigo in this pack. So we got Air Rods. Water Baby of Massacre Rock, the Beach, uh, the Bandage Man of Cannon Beach, Imprisonment, Bubbling Brew, Coffee Cup, Call It For Look, 
Adam Everywhere. Oh, I finally got injured Cole. Nice. Adam Everywhere shows up yet again. Every single opening, yeah. he's got to make an appearance. There's a bat on this one at least. Oh, nice. Yeah, apparently the bat's the hardest one to find in um. Just two in, bats in the here. hollow. Real? Yeah, there's one on either side of him. Oh, nice. I'll showcase that off to you guys. Um, so there's one here. In this corner right there, and then there's one right there, which is they're like perfectly lined up and everything. There's a skull up the top, we've got spider webs everywhere, and we're just missing the ghost. I see, yeah, missing the ghost. Well, that's good. Uh, this one was already open, yeah, that happens a bit apparently. That's weird. I swear I didn't. I might have pulled on that. I don't know, but I swear I didn't. Oh, well, I could probably keep this one as a nice one then. Look at this. Split it right at the top. Slide the cards out. Hmm. Oh, and then drop the cards nearly. <laughs> <laughs> so we got Aura Prowess. That, 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 that. Ah, oh, Full Hollow. Woods Devil of Coos Country. That's terrifying. If that came out of the bushes at night, I would fucking... Oh, I didn't yeah. mean to swear. <laughs> Whoops, sorry guys. I cut that out. Um, yeah, I would scream so much. <laughs> yeah, he's not a friendly looking one. No, like his teeth as well. Like they're all like yeah. jagged and broken and... Bigfoot, I'd like to think I'd be like, oh, hey. Yeah, hey dude. Okay. And he'd be like, yo, <laughs> just keep walking. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's the full hollow. Yeah. I was like, I've got another one that I need, but this is cool because you can have three of them per spell book. And I now think I've got two of them, if I recall. So I could nearly put them into my headless Annie deck. Four packs to go, guys. Our chances are getting slimmer and slimmer, but we will press on. Slide through these quick. Oh yes, yes <laughs> another one that I needed, and it's got the hollow on the tear. Like, remember your one of yours didn't? Well, maybe there was just no star in that part of the hollow sheet. Yeah, true. So it just didn't look like it. There's a little skull on the jack o' lantern up here. That's <laughs> nice. cool. Obsidian obelisk, a card that I'm so sick of seeing. It's not funny. <laughs> Three more packs to go. There is a mountain of wrappers next to me. Uh, what have we got this time? Uh, I skipped a card and we got lightning split again <laughs> and divine covenant again, which is quite nice. One per spell walk. Add each caster's life points together and divide the total by the number of casters rounded, ta uh, rounded down. Each caster has their life points set to the result and their book, and then bookmarks three, three pages. So that's a pretty cool card. Yeah. Bit of a reset. Yeah, well, it'd be cool if you only had like a hundred life points left mm. and your opponent had a thousand. Just immediately take half their life points and, and give yourself like back. a, yeah, give yourself like a second chance. Second last pack. Can we get anything? Ooh, craft and monster. Okay, guys, it's the last pack. If I pull old scratch from this, <laughs> I'll pick the camera up and my mate can film it and I'll attempt to do a backflip. Air rods, nightmare, mermaid shimmer, possession, feign death, spectre moose. Okay, it's definitely not. <laughs> oh, it's a Dover demon. <laughs> I think old scratch is in the um after the hollow spot. Oh, so he takes the regular air spot. Yeah. That's kinda cool. Well, sadly no god pack guys. However, that was a pretty good box for what I was needing. Um so we'll do a quick recap now. Uh, we'll just grab all the cards. There we go. So we got 
this. Hello, 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 remember this. Hello, 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 remember this. Hello, hello, reverse. That's a regular rare, so we don't count that. Reverse. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, <laughs> hello. Wow, there was a lot of hollows in this box. Yeah. Like a lot. Like. Hello, reverse, reverse, reverse. Hello, hello, hello. Reverse. That's another normal one. Full hollow, full hollow, reverse. So, we'll do reverses first, actually. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Almost. <clears throat> That's almost what you meant to get in hollows. That's like a third of the box. Yeah. Almost two thirds in hollows. Two thirds in full hollows. And we got some nice ones, man. Look at that. That's gorgeous. I don't have one to like play, but I could easily just use a non hollow to play. Old Books Crying Tree, I don't know, I have one to use, like, in a deck. Injured Coals, I've got a mountain of. Guardian Angels, I've got a mountain of. Flood the Earth, I'm glad I pulled this myself. Mm. I still didn't get to pull River of Time, I think was the only one that I didn't pull. Oh, wait, no, didn't I get that as well? No, I didn't. No, just a normal yeah. one. I'm a non high Boil over, Divine Covenant, nice looking card. Jack Foss, Full Hollow. We got Adam everywhere. <laughs> Headless coal miner, one of my favourites from the set. I just love headless things, I guess. But yeah, well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I'll do a quick recap of the binder now and just add it on to the end of this as a secondary clip. So uh, we'll say our goodbyes now. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video and. Hopefully we'll have a little bit more Meta Zoo to open for you guys, but you know, if not, stick around. We'll have plenty of Pokemon, Digimon. We'll be waiting for Wilderness to come out. It's got the yeah. Pin Club stuff coming, the Kickstarter poker cards. Yeah, we've we've got plenty on the rise, guys. So I really hope that you guys enjoyed this, and we'll see you on the next video. Peace. Thanks, guys. Bye.